So this is the pre-production uh, T-Mobile version. As you can see, it's got the 4G LTE logo up there. There at the top. On the network, unfortunately, because it is pre-production hardware and software, we're not doing speed tests or anything on it today. Okay. Uh, but can confirm that, yeah, it will launch on the LTE network sometime in the second quarter. All right. Sometime in the second quarter. Sometime in the second quarter. I don't know. I think uh, Mr. Ledger kind of leaked it. <clears throat> uh, Just saying. Someone said May 1st. And uh, people are welcome to say what they want. <laughs> <laughs> I like that answer. Very politic of you. Um, so obviously some of the great stuff about this device, the camera. So this is uh, actually leveraging our Galaxy Camera UI. Kind of see mode wheel, so easy access to all the features. And some of the new features like Drama Shot, which is multiple exposure. Mm -hmm. Um, and then we've also got Eraser, mm -hmm. which actually removes moving objects yeah. from the back of the frame. So some very cool stuff there. It's 13 megapixels or shutter lag. It takes fantastic images. Um, one of the other big things about it is Air View, so a feature we introduced on the Galaxy Note. Um, so you just hover above an email. That's pretty cool. Get a preview. You can do the same thing timeline in a movie, hover across the timeline. Okay, so now I'm going to ask for that special feature uh, with the looking away and pausing the... Uh, oh, absolutely. Because that's kind of cool. That's yeah, a, yeah, let me, sh let me show you. <laughs> that's the one thing I keep telling my friends while I'm getting the Galaxy S4. I'm like, you can look away and it pauses your video. All right, so this is a... Uh, so right, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to step back a little right, bit. so I will do that. Try to get it from behind here. Yeah, so let me uh, show you. So this is a roller coaster. This is actually done with dual shot. Okay. So one of the features of the camera where... Uh, let's do that off screen. Anyway, so if I look away, oh, that's pretty awesome. And then look back, it should come back. Here we go. That is pretty awesome. So, nice. And there you go, it comes back. Now, I know there's a feature in the Galaxy S3 that currently um, does basically, it checks to see if you're still reading the screen yep. and um, it keeps the screen on or off based on that. Yep. Now, is that based off of that technology or just an expanded Ex version of that technology? Exactly. It's an uh -huh. extension of the uh, Smart Stay feature, which smart ke stay. keeps the backlight on while you're looking at the screen. So, one of those enhancements is Smart Pause, okay. which you just showed when you look away from video. Another is Smart Scroll. Um, it may be a little dodgy in here because of the lighting, but what happens is it detects when you're looking at like a web page or a long email that it needs to scroll on, it'll actually detect you're looking at it and then you can just tilt the device oh, great. to tilt up or down on the Oh, tilt you tilt up or down the device. Yeah. Oh, okay. So it doesn't fully fo your eye motion, it just no, tilts no, it's, up it's down. not eye tracking, it's really just an extension of that kind of understands that you're kind of, you're either focused on the device or not. Okay, okay, that's a great clarification because yeah. I've heard a few different stories about that feature. Yeah. Well, thanks again for the no walk on the Galaxy S4, really appreciate it. And uh, I'm sure it's going to do well on launch. Well, thank you.